a meteor storm with a hundred Tunguskas? That's very real. That's very possible. There's nothing implausible about that at all. And a hundred Tunguskas would be about the equivalent of a major nuclear war. How long would it take to recover from it? Well, it all depends, I think, on the extent of the feedback effects. Because there could be extraordinary extreme feedback effects, which, which we don't really know about. I mean, we can look at the Tunguska event of 1908, we can see there were feedbacks, right? But what would a hundred of them, or a couple of hundred of them, imply with respect to the global climate? To changes in the biosphere, which we now know were a byproduct of the Tunguska event. The triggering of volcanism or seismicity, we, we just don't know. Or what if you had 10 objects that were, each one were, you know, 10 or 20 times as massive as Tunguska. Tunguska was about 15 megatons. So 10 times that, well, 15, so like four times that, and you've got a, an explosion greater than the greatest nuclear weapons test, nuclear bomb test ever by the Soviet Union, which was 50 megatons, right? Oh yeah, you better believe that's gonna cause extreme damage.